Okay, so I'm going to choose this one, edit, pop up. This is the website here. There we are going to edit. So this is a blog um, template. So here is the home. Here is your blogs, the videos, you can put here, boom, boom, boom. A button here can take you to your YouTube channel. Here is the picture yourself, something about you. Hi, my name is Anthony, some content about me. Follow me here on whatever social that you wanna add. Here also, you can add your social options. Here is your Instagram photos. And at the bottom, you can contact me here, my information. Okay, let's go to edit it. So this is what the edit page will look like when you're ready to edit. Uh, see here, I got these little blocks. You can move things around. And, you know, one thing about um, the Wix, um, the blocks are sensitive. So you have to uh, be careful. Um, it's a little more sensitive than other platforms that I work with. So that's something to keep in mind. So let's say, hey, we want to change this color. We will click, you see, change color. Click on that, and then option will show up. Click a color. Let's go with black. I said black, not gray. There we go. And as you see, it's black. Um, okay, so let's, and, you know, the, every time you touch a block, um, you know, it becomes a little, you know, like I said, it's definitely sensitive. So you want to keep that in mind. If your seats right here is Instagram feed. So you click on that, you will go to settings. And then to the left, see as it says Instagram feed. It will ask you to put your settings here for your Instagram website. Again, um, the platform uh, works a little slow, so you have to, you know, know it's going to be some time. Okay, so here you have your options. You have a business account or a personal account. Then you just pick your option and then connect it. Okay, we're not going to go into that. Okay, so let's scroll through. Um, You want to change your picture. You click a column and right here, change your background, the column. It's up to you how you want to change it. Manage your columns. Right here, so it says this is a section that I want to change. And if you click this one, it will go to your text side where it said, this is my story. So here we want to change and then you just choose whatever image you like. Uh, so, you know, it's not difficult. Um, 
I just want you to know with this platform here, um, the blocks are sensitive and you gotta make sure you have time because uh, the process is a little slow um, than other platforms. So you just gotta go with the flow if this is the platform that you choose to use. So here are you manage go your, your videos. You go to manage videos. You know, and I, I I like this platform. I use this platform for um, different things. Um, is is great for using um you know if you want to use the html html um for whatever project you're using the wix platform is great for that you do not need any coding to set up anything use blocks pictures images um and, and it's great it's, it's a great um it's a great platform for what you use it for. Um, I do not build a lot of websites with the Wix platform. I actually use it for other other things, um, but um, they offer free websites, which is great for people who do not want to spend the extra money. Me, my suggestion is to pick a price plan. Um, I think that's the best way to go. Here it shows you different options. So this is your dashboard here and how it breaks up your live stream channels, your videos, booking services, plugins. And and if you watch my other videos, it shows these are the options I selected. So I select blog, I select booking, subscription. These are what I selected. So that's why they are here. There's also a marketplace where you can select um, so many options. Um, you can um, do so much with the Wix platform. It offers um, a lot of features for you. Um, so, you know, you just have to log in, play around, get familiar with the platform. Here you can do two options. You can add your YouTube, URL here and your YouTube picture, your video will show up or you can upload a video. So you have options um, for setting up this video um, section block here. So, and then, you know, there's the header. Here's your logo um, over here. One thing I always say about this is your logo is that and in your page is that you you when you editing your page always check switch to the mobile side to see what your um your website will look like because a lot of times your website looks great that you set up on um the the the, the your desktop side but when you switch to the website and you see on the mobile, it looks totally different. So um, when it low, you see how it looks different. Here is, um, it said meet your site on mobile. So what happens here is that they have different features that you can set up. So let's go through it. Let me show you um, what options that they give. Um, also, there's an app. There's a, a Wix app that you can also uh, choose. And with the app is that you can um, send your customers, your clients, and to download the Wix app, and then they can log in to only your page um, on their on the app. So, which is also a great option because if you don't want to have your own app, you can use the Wix app. Here are different options. So um, you want this button right here, which is the shows right here. It's um, back to top option. When you click it, it shows up. So 
to your website which yes i do want that okay um aic skips and features let's go back here it asks you different things so to the right it shows you um the demonstration to the right so it's going to click one it will show you so this here your header will disappear you see how your header disappears so no longer here it goes up when you scroll um it leaves so here this one will fades out so you see the header it fades out when it strolls up this one is fixed so it's no matter what it will stay so we're going to go with the stroll with the page um so this is your button right here see the chat button right here that stays like that so you can leave it as is or you can change it this one will show at the bottom like that you see it says chat and then you also can change the color of right here so you can change the color you can make it black make it white blue whatever uh, this one will remove it altogether. You have nothing. I actually like it, so I will leave it. And then hit next. And you see, you know, it's the process. It takes some time when you're dealing with websites, web space. Um, it's not as fast as you might think. A lot of times, you know, you watch videos and you think, oh, it's so fast. But when you do it yourself, you're like, oh, no, this is, it takes a lot of my time. And it does. It takes a lot of your time. All right. So that, that skips away. Let's pull up the site. Okay, so as you see here, it's showing the site, but okay, now also here. So right here, this would hide um, on the mobile site. So it would still show on your dash, on your desktop um, version, but on the mobile version, you will um, not see it. So if you want to remove certain parts, um, so I say this action bar, I have, uh, I change my mind, I don't want it. I will click the hide section and boop, it will disappear. Um, if I want to, and it shows you right here, um, when it says hit on a mobile, um, would you click this button here? It will show you everything that you have. And you can choose a show or no show. So you click the button, it will disappear, it won't show up. Um, and you know, it's up to you, however you want it. Um, but you know, the mobile, the mobile app and the mobile section is totally different from the desktop. It gives the same content, but you can change the site difference. So, um, you know, that can be a whole video by itself talking about the mobile so um and you can remove like i said you can remove whatever you want if you just want if you don't want the content information shown on the mobile or you want to put different buttons or you want to design the mobile website totally different from the desktop you can you can have two different versions you can have one version um, the desktop, and then you can have the mobile look totally different. It's up to you because of the block is here. You click here, um, and it gives you all of the options to set up however you want it. So you can choose whatever you want, buttons, whatever, um, and set up your site. So, you know, I just wanted to give you a breakdown if you Want to know more about the, the Wix platform? Let me know. 
I can do a video based on what you want to know, or if you're having problems with the Wix website, and there's certain things that you are uh, interested in that you would like me to do a video on, just let me know. Uh, we'll uh, do a video for you. So uh, thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel, and I will continue to update new videos. I am going to do a video uh, right now on Squarespace. Um, I think Squarespace is also have a great platform, so I'm going to do another video on that one. So thank you for watching.